We shouldn't have to hide like this at all. You know Kevin. After a sky cry, there's lots of mud puddles around. And he can't resist jumping in them to splat us. Hey, we should mud splat him first. Wouldn't that be even more stupid? At least it would get him back. He might even learn a lesson. <laughs> I wouldn't count on it. Perhaps we should try it anyway. <laughs> So they're going to mud splat me before I mud splat them, eh? We'll see about that. Kevin! Where are you? We have something fun to do to you! There he is. Splat away! <laughs> we got him! <laughs> huh? So who exactly has got who? But we thought you were behind the bush! Oh, I can explain that. Clever or what? It's almost Wally clever. Oh. Ah! Splat on target. I would never do anything so childish. But you were going to splat me, Wall. I would never do anything so childish from now on. Well, come on, gang. It was only fun. <laughs> Does it look like we're laughing? OK, well, maybe you'll laugh later. We can do without your sort of fun, Kevin. Sometimes I think we can do without Kevin. You don't really mean it when you say you can do without my fun. Don't you like fun, gang? Well, later on, they'll know it was only fun. They're taking it way too serious. If I wasn't here, they'd miss my fun. They'd miss me. <sighs> What a nap and a half. Mud splatting fun really wears you out. I hope the gang isn't so grumpy with me now. Hi, Eddie. Did you see what I did? I got the gang with the best sticky mud splat ever. It was sweet. Who are you? What are you on about, Eddie? What are you? Come on, Eddie. It's just me. <laughs> Eddie, come back. Up. What are you doing? Go away, you big scary me! Okay, okay, Eddie. Poor Eddie's gone as barmy as a bandicoot. I've got to find the gang and get help for Eddie. Whoa, here's trouble. Christy with the cat. <laughs> this I've got to see. Look, Mog, it doesn't matter what you say. I'm not backing down. And I'm not backing down either. She hates those cats. This could get ugly. If I've told you once, I've told you a million times. I love you cats more than you love me. Galloping Joannas. No, no, Pumpkin. We love you more. Poor Christy's lost on marbles. Hey, let's not argue about who loves who more. Let's just agree that we all love each other the same. <laughs> everybody loves everybody. I love everyone. Big hug. Oh, great hug. Oh. I've got to get help. Oh, oh, hey, Nanny. It's spreading this this madness. He was this big, and he talked funny, and he walked funny, and <gasps> there he is! Ah! Well, Emily, you gotta come with me. Christine needs help. Well, Emily, do you hear me? You seem to know our names, but we don't know your name. I'm Kevin. Kevin the kangaroo. Kangaroo? What are you two playing at? <laughs> not bad, not bad at all. What are you talking about, Kangapoo? Oh, I'm talking about this joke you're playing on me to get back at me for mud splatting you. Very clever. Joke? Mud splat? What is this language you speak, Kangamoo? <laughs> okay, okay. <laughs> you want to keep the joke going, that's great. I'll play along. It's all fun, right? We should take him to Mr. Lizard. Good idea, Emily. Mr. Lizard will know what to do. So you've even got old Mr. Lizard in on the joke. Lead the way. I'm always ready for a good laugh. Mm. Oh. Uh, ah! uh, uh, oh. Uh, uh, <sighs> he 
easy does it, Mr Lizard. You can take a joke too far. <sighs> well, children, do you know what this creature is? What, Mr Lizard? I have no idea. I was hoping you knew. You know I'm a kangaroo, Mr Lizard. Come on, this joke's getting a little on the nose. You see, Mr Lizard, he talks the same as us, but we don't understand him. Hmm. I call on my brightest student to give us his always intelligent and insightful view on this, sir. Uh, what did you say you were? A kangaroo. Kangaroo. That's Roo. Roo. Hmm. How fascinating. <laughs> nice touch on the joke wall. <laughs> Making Garbo the smartest. But Garbo is the smartest. At first, I thought this creature might have been the Nivik. The Nivik? What's a Nivik? The most terrifying, hideous, and rudest creature ever to walk the earth. A big, clumsy giant. Always doing the wrong thing. Always upsetting other animals. Hang on, there's no such thing as a Nivik at Kangaroo Creek. I see your confusion, strange creature. This isn't Kangaroo Creek. It isn't? No, it's Cat Creek. Cat Creek? Look, I think we should let him stay until he feels better. Oh, you're so smart and kind and handsome, Garbo. A joke is supposed to be funny, but this joke has gone from weird and funny to just seriously weird. And that's how I rescued everybody, saved the creek, and became friends with the great dingo. Hooray! Tell us again, Garbo. You know, we'll never tire of hearing your glorious tales of valour and heroicism. Enough is enough because it's enough. I mean, you've had your joke. <laughs> well, see, I laughed. You can stop it now. Poor Kangaboo. He still doesn't understand this isn't his home. It's Kangaroo. Roo, I tell you. Yeah, whatever you said, friend. I know the way to stop this joke. Hop, hop. Oh. <laughs> Come on, gang. Get angry with me and stop this joke. Why do you want us to get angry with you? Yes, we just want to love you like we love each other. OK, well, that's it. No, today's a day that makes me smile. I'm happy to be a crocodile. Look out! Croc! But, Kevin... Get back. I'll take care of this. A creature that I've never seen. Why are you so very mean? Get out of here, you big lumpy lizard. I don't want to be unkind, but you've truly lost your mind. I know how to handle that big old croc. I've no need to thank me, gang. All in a day's work. Why did you scare away our friend the croc? The croc? A friend? Now this has taken a joke too far. Just stop it, will you? OK, I call a special gang meeting. One without the kangazoo. <laughs> what if this isn't a joke? Where am I? What's happened to my home? What's happened to my friend? He's loud. Big and noisy. He thinks fun is playing tricks on others. Hey, gang, what are you talking about? We're discussing a decision. And we've decided our decision. And our decision is that you leave right away. But, but why? Everything was wonderful until you came. And things will be wonderful again when you go. Because we love each other, but we don't love you. But this is my home. Oh, I think it's my home. Not anymore. We're changing the name of the creek. From now on, we're calling it No Kevin Creek. Because there'll be no Kevins here. <laughs> oh, it's the Nevik. Leave this to me. I'm the biggest. I'll protect you from this Nevik. This Nevik is in for a bad if he reckons he can mess with Kevin Kang and Doop. Ow! Yeah, I'm starting to do it. I can't look at it. Yeah, it's a nightmare. <laughs> What's up, gang? <laughs> Galloping Goannas. <laughs> Galloping Goannas. Ah! <laughs> oh, you're taking me. Go away. <sighs> Where is everyone? Where's that Nevik? Oh. It was a dream. It was only a dream. Wait up. What if this is the dream and the other one was real? <laughs> Eddie, who am I? Who am I? Tell me! Uh, you're Kevin. <laughs> Eddie knows me. Eddie knows me. Kevin's gone as balmy as a bandicoot. Look, Mog, it doesn't matter what you say. I'm not backing down. And I'm not backing down either. We're sick of 
you trying to fish here. And we're sick of you trying to be the boss of us. Christy, you're not arguing about how much you love each other, are you? Is that supposed to be funny? Gabbo, Gabbo, tell me you're not smart. Please, you're still an idiot. Oh, yeah, I'm still an idiot. Mange, tell me you don't love the Thal. I don't love the Thal. OK, boys, let's give him time to find his tiny brain. This is so fantastic. You and the cats don't love each other. Kevin's as nutty as a fruit bat. I've got to get help. <laughs> Gang, Kevin's acting strange. So what else is new? Emily, he's acting more strange than normal. No, I hardly think that's possible, Christy. Gang. Up, up, uh, what's the name of the creek? Please tell me it isn't No Kevin Creek, please. The creek's called what it's always been called, Kangaroo Creek. Kangaroo, roo, you said it right! And the Nevek, there is no Nevek, right? No, Kevin, there is no such thing as a Nevek. So it was only a dream and, and this is for real, this is my home. Oh, dang, I'm sorry about that mud splatting business. I know I can be big and clumsy and I do the wrong thing sometimes, but... You forgive me, don't you? We forgive you, Kevin. And I know you'd miss me if I wasn't around. I I know that. Oh, Kevin, of course we would miss you. If you weren't here, well, we couldn't do this. Hi! It's blood and mud on each other. Now that's what being a friend is all about. Yeah! <laughs> 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 <laughs>